Pair of bright fairy voice Let's get the L Okay, so I just went to the bank, and the bank, I went to the drive-thru, and the bank lady recognized me. That's pretty crazy. <laughs> she asked me if I was winning any new contests lately. I was like, what the heck? Well, I didn't say that. I was just like, no. <laughs> I just started laughing, but it, it's, that's pretty funny. I don't think she saw me through the cam that well. I think she just knew my name. Guess what, guys? We're putting our cover of Safe and Sound on iTunes. We figured out a way to do that. We are getting a mechanical license for it. That way we can repay, like, royalties to Taylor Swift and whatever her thing is. So she gets part of the money and stuff, and I guess that's legal. So we're doing it. So be excited to get it on iTunes. Look, Sabrina could float. DJ and I are quickly starting to realize how important covers are. I mean, we learn a lot from them. Sometimes they don't work out, but a lot of times we freaking, we do great on them. I'm thinking that we need to just step it up a notch to just start doing covers like at least twice a week, at least. We're thinking just to keep doing covers and every once in a while releasing an original song until we are big enough to release an album that will do great, you know? So, I mean, look at Carmen. You guys know who Carmen is? They, they have like Carmen covers on YouTube. It's a guy and a girl and they do different kinds of music. Well, they just do covers. Like, they just do a crap ton of covers and they're huge now and they have a song on the radio and it's awesome. Like, that's how awesome YouTube is. So, that's, that's the direction we're gonna take ourselves in, I guess. We're just gonna, we're gonna stick with covers Stick with, I mean, obviously intros are really important, but I mean, I feel like we've done an intro for like a lot of people. You know how we were talking about how we were putting polls on our website yesterday? One of our polls asks how you found us. And we've got a cover song that we did, an original song that we did, um, a friend. We got, we, I don't remember what we have, but one of them is a, an intro for a YouTuber that we did. And that one is like way over here, like, oh, a lot of you, most of you, have found us through an intro that we did. That's how important intros are because we're targeting the YouTube audience. I mean, there's lots of people that are going to come in to go listen to music on YouTube, but it doesn't mean that most of them are YouTubers and they know how to use YouTube and they know how everything works, share, favorite, like, they don't even know what any of that is. They might not even have accounts. They just go there and listen to it. But it's really, really important to get YouTube people, people who like YouTube, who understand the YouTube community, and that is why we do intros, because it's just our way of collaborating with other YouTubers and spreading, you know what I mean? So we're gonna continue doing intros every once in a while, but covers for now. And then, I mean, don't worry, we're still gonna do original songs. I personally, I want to do at least one, if not more, at least one original song a month, but I don't wanna release it until we have like six songs or something and then we can just take our other original songs and put it with those six songs and we could have a full album right there and release it just release it as an album without anybody have heard those six songs or whatever however many we put on there but i i just feel like we need to keep writing music in the background but release these covers grow our channel and then once we've got our album done it'll be awesome like, I've just been doing a lot of thinking, so... DJ wants to cover a Nelly song that just came out, and it's a pretty cool song. But this time, DJ's gonna do most of the singing on it, because it kind of calls for him to sing on it, and I'm just gonna do some harmonies. So I think that's what we're doing next. Alright, I guess DJ decided he doesn't want to do the Nelly one just yet. We're gonna, um... I'm talking about the cover. We're gonna do Where Have You Been by Rihanna. Well, we're gonna try might not come out as good as we think because it's um it's really techno-y and usually we're not good at that kind of stuff that's why the t-pain thing didn't come out too well we're gonna try and make it heavy so it might not be as bad what it smells really gross what wash you my hands why are you washing your hands in here because i was listening to you i like to hear your beautiful voice dj what are you doing dj you're, you're being creepy. 
You're a creeper today. <laughs> <laughs> I just want to remind you guys, if you haven't looked at our website yet, you should go subscribe and check it out. I post mobile pictures on there like every once in a while and we update you. And I feel like we should start this thing where we release like songs to you guys like like to hear before everybody else or something. I don't know, is that a good idea? Status update on where have you been? We have got the string, DJ got some strings done and he's working on drums and they're really intense. This is gonna be pretty sick. I have a good feeling about this one <coughs> because I can sing it pretty well. I mean, T-Pain was a whole different kind of story because it's not really, I don't know. I jam out to this in the car, so I already know all the words. This is gonna be really cool. I think this is a song. I think it's La Bamba or something. I can't tell. Yeah, yeah.